हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू ए डिस्कशन ऑफ इम्पॉर्टेंट केस दैट इज न्योनेटल फिजियोलॉजिकल जॉन्डिस दिस इज इम्पॉर्टेंट केस एंड वेरी वेरी इम्पॉर्टेंट केस फ्रीक्वेंटली आस्क फॉर यूनिवर्सिटी एग्जामिनेशन फॉर फर्स्ट एम स्टूडेंट्स इन द यूनिवर्सिटी एग्जामिनेशन सो वी आर इन द अर्ली क्लिनिकल एक्सपोजर इन द बायो सब्जेक्ट द टॉपिक ऑफ डिस्कशन इज हिमोग्लोबिन केमिस्ट्री एंड मेटाबोलिज्म एंड केस ऑफ डिस्कशन इज द न्योनेटल फिजियोलॉजिकल जॉन्डिस नाउ विल सी द केस सी ए थर्टी वन ईयर ओल्ड मदर डिलीवर्ड ए प्रीमेच्योर बेबी डिलीवर्ड ए प्रीमेच्योर बेबी एट थर्टी फोर वीक्स ऑफ गेस्टेशन बेबी क्राइड वेल आफ्टर द बर्थ ऑल रिफ्लेक्सेस वेर नॉर्मल But three days after birth, mother observed yellow skin, yellow skin and eyes. Okay, on blood examination, indirect bilirubin was found to be eleven milligram per de deciliter. Indirect bilirubin. Now remember that when jaundice it appears on third day of life, on third day of life it is known as physiological jaundice. and when it is within 24 hours after the birth it is known as pathological jaundice and most common cause of pathological jaundice is rh incompatibility okay followed by the abo incompatibility but here there is nothing mentioned about the blood groups and the jaundice appear but 3 days after birth see jaundice appears after 3 days after the birth so it indicates it is a case of neonatal physiological jaundice and this is frequently ask clinical case from hemoglobin chemistry and metabolism because it is quite common in the community in this neonatal physiological jaundice bilirubin can go, go up to 14 15 mg per deciliter or can be up to 20 mg per de deciliter but rarely goes beyond 20 in neonatal physiological jaundice so here indirect bilirubin is raised indirect bilirubin unconjugated bilirubin increases so what is what is the most probable diagnosis here so here answer is neonatal physiological jaundice what do you mean by jaundice jaundice means yellowish discoloration of skin and sclera yellowish discoloration of skin and sclera sclera because of increased bilirubin level and why it appears first in the eyes because of the contrast because of the white color of the sclera and the second important reason is the sclera has elastic tissues and bilirubin has affinity with the elastic tissue that's why it appears first in the sclera so yellow is discolor discoloration of skin and sclera because of increased bilirubin level now what is the most appropriate treatment modality before that that what is the cause of neonatal neonatal physiological jaundice because of prematurity and immature hepatic system there is low activity of low activity of enzyme which causes conjugation of bilirubin so unconjugated bilirubin is the toxic compound it is water insoluble compound for the conjugation of bilirubin which occurs in the hepatocytes the enzyme is required the name of the enzyme is udp glucuronyl transferase udp glucuronyl transferase this enzyme causes conjugation of bilirubin and unconjugated bilirubin is converted into bilirubin monoglucuronide so unconjugated bilirubin it is converted into bilirubin monoglucuronide first then it is converted into bilirubin diglucuronide this is known as conjugated bilirubin water soluble bilirubin less toxic water soluble bilirubin that is known as conjugated bilirubin so unconjugated bilirubin in laboratory it is known as indirect bilirubin and conjugated bilirubin it is known as direct bilirubin because it is estimated by the vandenberg reaction 
द प्रिंसिपल ऑफ बिलुरुबिन इस्टिमेशन इन द प्रिंसिपल ऑफ बिलुरुबिन इस्टिमेशन सी बिलुरुबिन रिएक्ट्स विथ डाय अजोटाइज सल्फेनिलिक एसिड टू गिव अजो बिलुरुबिन विच इज पर्पल कलर कॉम्प्लेक्स दिस इज पर्पल पिंक टू पर्पल इन कलर ओके सो दिस इज प्रिंसिपल ऑफ बिलुरुबिन इस्टिमेशन इट इज नोन एज वैंडेनबर्ग रिएक्शन एंड इनडायरेक्ट पॉजिटिव वैंडेनबर्ग रिएक्शन इनडायरेक्ट पॉजिटिव इज ए फीचर ऑफ हिमोलिटिक जॉन्डिस दैट इज इंक्रीज इन अनकॉन्जुकेटेड बिलुरुबिन बिकॉज डिक्रीज कैपेसिटी और इमेच्योर लीवर और इमेच्योर हिपैटोसाइट इमेच्योर हिपैटोसाइट टू कॉन्जुकेट बिलुरुबिन दिस इज ए रीजन to conjugate bilirubin this is a reason for neonatal physiological jaundice because of increased hemolysis and immature hepatic system to conjugate the bilirubin this is a reason for uh, neonatal physiological jaundice and jaundice appears second second day or third day of life after second or third day of life if it is within 24 hour it is known as pathological jaundice okay now see what is most appropriate treatment modality here phototherapy is given aap neonatal unit mein agar gaye honge kabhi ya pediatric icu mein abhi aapne aapne kabhi dekha hoga to ek blue color ke rack jaise uh, instrument mein bacche ko rakha rehta so that is phototherapy unit phototherapy unit blue light is given in the treatment the nanometer is 420 to 470 nanometer that is blue light it is given in the treatment that is known as phototherapy that is known as phototherapy what is the basis of phototherapy phototherapy converts isliye bolte the pehle bolte the ki dhoop mein rakho bacche ko subah subah ke subah wali jo dhoop rehti hai usme rakho so phototherapy the nanometer 420 to 470 nanometer blue light converts unconjugated bilirubin it converts unconjugated bilirubin into non toxic soluble isomer it converts it into non toxic water soluble excretable form excretable form that is lumirubin lumirubin and it is excreted in the urine so it it gives response to phototherapy there is decrease in the bilirubin level on phototherapy so bilirubin absorb light of 420 to 470 nanometer that is blue light and the bilirubin level decreases because unconjugated bilirubin is converted into water soluble excretable form of the bilirubin or photoisomer of bilirubin that is lumirubin and it is excreted in the urine so bilirubin level decreases and jaundice decreases so phototherapy is given in the treatment of neonatal physiological jaundice what is kernic terrace when bilirubin level goes about 20 about 25 mg per de deciliter the capacity of albumin albumin has high affinity binding site and near about 25 mg per 100 ml or per deciliter this is a capacity of high affinity albumin sites uh, which occupies the bilirubin means high affinity binding sites of albumin to this site the bilirubin get attached and when it goes about 25 mg per deciliter it diffuses into the tissue and in the newborn or particularly in the premature neonate be because of immature blood brain barrier this unconjugated bilirubin enters the brain and all of you know that unconjugated bilirubin is a is an uncoupler so see this so immature blood brain barrier in the preterm neonate blood brain barrier and increase bilirubin that is unconjugated bilirubin more than 20 or more than 25 mg per deciliter it crosses the blood brain barrier and enters into a brain and toxic manifestation causes toxic manifestations in the form of seizures conversion this is because bilirubin unconjugated bilirubin it is uncoupler 
इट इज अनकप्लर वॉट डू मीन बाय अनकप्लर इट इज फिजियोलॉजिकल अनकप्लर डी लिंक्स द इलेक्ट्रॉन ट्रांसपोर्ट चेन फ्रॉम ऑक्सीडेटिव फॉस्फोराइलेशन सो नो ए टी पी सिंथेसिस ऑकर्स ओनली हीट जनरेशन विल ऑकर सो अनकॉन्जुगेटेड बिलोरोबिन वेन क्रॉसेज द ब्लड ब्रेन बैरियर इट एक्ट एज ए अनकप्लर इट डैमेज द ब्रेन देर इज प्रोडक्शन ऑफ हीट विदाउट प्रोडक्शन ऑफ ए टी पी एंड इट डैमेज द ब्रेन दैट कॉज इज द न्यूरोलॉजिकल मैनिफेस्टेशन इन द न्यूनेट दैट इज नोन एज कर्निक टेरस when bilirubin level goes about 20 or 25 mg per deciliter this condition is known as kernic terus there are other causes congenital causes of increase in the bilirubin level there are causes for indirect hyperbilirubinemia and direct hyperbilirubinemia indirect hyperbilirubinemia includes krigler nager type 1 and type 2 also gilbert syndrome while the direct hyperbilirubinemia the causes are the dobin johnson syndrome rotor syndrome but this is neonatal physiological jaundice is the most frequently asked question in the university examination particularly there uh, the sub question will be there on the phototherapy what do you mean by kernic terus and what is your probable diagnosis so jaundice means it is a condition it is a clinical condition it is not a disease so neonatal physiological jaundice means when jaundice appears on third day or second day or third day of life or fourth day of life it appears okay and it gradually the unconjugated bilirubin increases and up to certain level means 12 13 14 uske baad mein drop hona dheere dheere drop hona chalu ho jata hai that is known as neonatal physiological jaundice pathological jaundice ke causes alag hai usme sabse main hai rh incompatibility abo incompatibility okay now see indirect bilirubin in this uh, in this uh, neonatal physiological jaundice so bilirubin total bilirubin is divided there are two types of total bilirubin one is the direct bilirubin and one is indirect bilirubin so indirect bilirubin level increases it can be up to 14 15 mg per deciliter okay can be up to but can go beyond 20 also in some cases and that causes the kernic terus if it goes beyond 25 the exchange transfusion is needed otherwise phototherapy is sufficient and some some uh, neonates that do not respond to the phototherapy phenobarbitone is given Phenobar phenobarbitone is hepatic inducer it induces the conjugation uptake conjugation and secretion of bilirubin so phenobarbitone is given if bilirubin is at higher level okay so this is now see this case a 4 day old neonate was admitted to hospital with jaundice with jaundice so jaundice is not a disease it is a condition it is it is a uh, sign okay the child was born by full term normal delivery at 38 weeks of gestation weight was 3 kg having no apparent complications on the fourth day after birth see on the fourth day after birth mother notice yellow is discoloration of sclera on laboratory investigation serum total bilirubin was 21 and indirect bilirubin was 19.2 mg per deciliter the normal range of indirect bilirubin is 0.2 to 0.7 mg per deciliter indirect bilirubin and direct bilirubin it is 0.1 to 0.4 mg per deciliter so it is serum total bilirubin 21 and indirect bilirubin 19.2 mg per deciliter there was no blood blood group incompatibility phototherapy was started and bilirubin level showed a decreasing trend after 12 24 and 48 hours so what is what should be the probable diagnosis so what may be the question other questions may be there uh, uh, what is that uh, what should be the given in the treatment that is phototherapy what is the mechanism of phototherapy why there is neonatal physiological jaundice because unconjugated bilirubin increases because of immature hepatic system and low activity of udp glucuronyl transferase and what do you mean by kernic terus there may be sub question on bilirubin metabolism it is if it is ask as long answer question or long assay type clinical case there may be question on bilirubin metabolism which includes the heme degradation pathway in which 
heme is converted into bilirubin bilirubin is converted into bilirubin bilirubin is transported bound to albumin then it is taken up by the hepatocyte hepatocyte by the process that is known as facilitated diffusion then conjugation of bilirubin occurs in the hepatocyte with the help of udp gluconeal transferase and secretion of bilirubin into bile canaliculi occur with the help of active transport then it is into the intestine and intestine this bilirubin is converted into urobilinogen and urobilinogen it is converted into stercobilinogen and excreted in the feces while some escape enters the enterohepatic circulation and through kidney it is excreted as urobilin so characteristic pale color of urine it because of the urobilin so this is in short about the bilirubin and neonatal physiological jaundice thank you